Hey. What are you doing then, uh, then? Our first bit of maintenance on the road. Because I have my boost gauge plumbed in with this coming off this little T piece. But the T piece just split. And obviously, no boost gauge and a boost leak. So yeah. I'm going to have to remove it for now and look for a better. A better tea piece. I need to cut those. But it's alright. I know what the boost's set at now, so we can run without it. And I'll just find a, a better version. Oh, it's just disintegrated. It's ridiculous. <laughs> yeah. The other piece is still in the other end. It was a T. Absolute rubbish. It said it was good on eBay. <laughs> it said it was good for 800 horsepower turbo cars, so I would say that's wrong. <laughs> there we good. go. Nothing too serious. We carry on. <laughs> if I can get the other piece out the other end. Your too. bloody catch can fell off, didn't it? Oh, gosh. Oh, that's caught quite a bit of oil already. Luckily it didn't fall out the bottom. It must oh. have just not been tight. I didn't even check it when I put it on, really, so... I was like, what's that metallic rattling? I was like, sake, is that like a... I don't know, one of the pump bearings or fan bearings or something? Yeah. But it was just that rattling around on the steering arm. Do you know what? I didn't even hear. They're so lucky that didn't fall out the bottom. Then what would it have been? Well, we would have had a catch can system just spitting oil everywhere. Too lovely. And this is my job. Every time when we stop, <laughs> I've got to go and check the caravan wheels because one of them obviously was a bit hotter than the other. Oh, that's cold. People are looking, thinking, what's this nutter holding a camera walking around? <laughs> yes, I love selfies. That's a bit warm. Yeah, for some reason, left one keeps making a bit of a hmm, heat, so can't do much about it. Left one's uh, a bit warm, but nothing as hot as it was yesterday, so. Always gets a bit warm. How's the catch can? It's back on, let's hope it stays on. Let's go. Set up. With 70 
point turns and ripping um, what was that kind of tape? I don't know, is it called like a security tape? Not yeah. security tape. Basically doing off roading with a caravan. It's like a dead end in the campsite, which was stupid. It's a very small campsite and obviously no one in the reviews have said that with a caravan is anyway. quite difficult. And we had so many people coming up to us saying like, oh there is a space. Someone else by the like, yeah, we so, weren't oh, looking for a space, space. we tried to just get out. We were like, oh actually we're a bit zigzagged. Pressure's on. Um, it's the heat. Plus 28. Being new to the caravan world, it was quite like a baptism of fire. Really. I was just going to say that. Yeah, let me set up now. It's a nice spot. Yep. Under the oak tree. I think it's alpine oak actually. Thank you. 
it's so warm. It's incredible. Toasted. Just put your hand out, it's like, ooh, it's like hair dry. <laughs> Do it again. Does that stop? It's unbelievable how warm it is. And it's closed. 